Hello everyone, my name is Qin Jie Zhou. Today I'm going to present our work, Patch to Pix Epipolar Guided Pixel Level Correspondences. This is a joint work with Thorsten Settler, Laura Liu Taishi. Given a pair of images, our task is to establish its pixel correspondences. This is an essential task for topics like 3D reconstruction, visual slam, and visual localization. A commonly adopted solution for this task is key point based matching. Key points are firstly detected and described based on its local features. Those key points are then matched exhaustively using their descriptors. Outliers are further filtered according to some metrics. Recently emerged correspondence networks perform the matching task inside a single network. NCNet first extracts dense descriptors from images which are matched via correlation layer followed by a neighborhood consensus module to filter outliers. Due to having to store all potential matches in the correlation map, NCNet is memory limited. Therefore, it needs to operate on low spatial image resolution, meaning a feature match corresponds to a patch match in the original image. In order to match higher resolution feature maps, Sparse NCNet used a sparse 4D correlation volume. Our concurrent work, Dual RCNet, first obtains cross matches with low resolution features and then rematch for promising candidates at a higher resolution. Compared to them, we use a regression based refinement network to improve the matching accuracy. We propose our detect to refine matching framework inspired by faster RCNN. We first detect patch level match proposals and then refine them to pixel level matches. Our refinement network patch to pix refines a detected proposal by classifying it to be a correctly matched inlier or an outlier. For an inlier proposal, a pixel correspondence is regressed within the local patches. Notice our framework is not limited to improve NCNet only, it also applies to the other methods that suffer from the trade-off between matching accuracy and memory efficiency. Now let's have a look at the details of the refinement procedure. Given a detected match proposal, we first locate the two patches centered by the correspondent points. Then we collect multi-level features for the two patches. Using the CNN features extracted at detection stage, and the two patch features are fused by concatenation. After feature collection, we use a regression network to regress the locations of a pixel correspondence within the local patches and output a confidence score for the patch proposal. Here, the score is supposed to be low for wrongly matched patches, since there will be no valid pixel matches to predict. The cross proposal is then updated to give the final refined pixel correspondence. Patch to pix performs two levels of search refinement to progressively expand the local searching space for pixel matches. The output of the first refinement serves as the input proposal for next level of refinement. For classification, we penalize the confidence score using balanced binary cross entropy laws. To learn geometrically consistent matches at the level of weak supervision, we optimize the Sampson distance of a regressed match with respect to its fundamental matrix. We show patch to pix learns to identify bad outliers, and the matches assigned with higher confidence are consistent with the inliers kept by Ransack. Evaluating on edge patches, we show patched peaks improves NCNet matches significantly and the viewpoint changes, and outperforms sparse NCNet. Patched peaks can handle extreme illumination changes and large to almost flipped viewpoint changes. We further show patched peaks trained on NCNet also generalizes to improve other types of proposals such as super blue or caps matches. This also leads us to state-of-the-art accuracy on in-log for indoor localization. The same conclusion also applies to outdoor localization on Ahan day and night. Thanks for watching the video. We are looking forward to talking to you in our poster session.